Have you ever wondered what Japanese women think of Western men? Are there cultural gaps or shared interests? In this era of global connectivity, these perceptions are more relevant than ever. Let's delve into the heart of the matter and discover what Japanese women really think about Western men. First let's tackle the elephant in the room, cultural differences. Japan and the West are two worlds apart, each with their unique cultural norms and social etiquette that shape their societies. These differences are not just superficial, they're embedded deep within the societal fabric, coloring every aspect of life, including the realms of dating and relationships. In Japan, the culture is largely group-oriented. The Japanese phrase wa o mamoru, meaning to protect the harmony, encapsulates the importance placed on maintaining social order and harmony. This is reflected in their social interactions where subtlety, indirectness, and respect for hierarchy are highly valued. On the other hand, Western cultures tend to be more individualistic, valuing personal freedom, direct communication, and equality. These contrasting cultural norms can lead to misunderstandings and miscommunications in cross-cultural relationships. Now let's talk about dating norms. In Japan, it's common for men to take the lead. They're often expected to make the first move, plan the dates, and generally steer the relationship. It's a norm deeply rooted in their society, with a good 70% of Japanese women stating that men should pay for the first date. In contrast, Western dating norms have been shifting towards a more balanced dynamic. The rise of gender equality movements has challenged traditional gender roles with a growing number of women taking the initiative in relationships. These cultural and dating norms are not just abstract concepts, they're lived experiences that shape perceptions and expectations. According to a survey conducted by the Japan Family Planning Association, around 40% of Japanese women expressed interest in dating Western men, citing their perceived openness, expressiveness, and egalitarian approach to relationships as appealing factors. However, it's crucial to remember that these are general trends and do not represent everyone's experiences or preferences. The beauty of cultural diversity is that it allows for a multitude of perspectives and experiences. These cultural differences undeniably play a massive role in shaping Japanese women's perceptions of Western men. The silver screen has a substantial impact on our perceptions, doesn't it? It's no surprise that what we see in movies and television shows can shape our beliefs and attitudes. This is particularly true when it comes to the depiction of Western men in Hollywood productions which are consumed by audiences around the globe, including Japan. Let's dive a bit deeper. Hollywood, being the behemoth of global entertainment that it is, has a reach that extends far and wide. In fact, it's been reported that, in the last decade, Hollywood films have consistently made up over 50% of the box office revenue in Japan. This means that more than half of the films being watched in Japan are Western productions predominantly from Hollywood. So, what does this mean for Japanese women's perceptions of Western men? Well, it's all about representation. Hollywood often portrays Western men as confident, assertive, and adventurous. These character traits, although not exclusive to Western men, are often emphasized in Hollywood films. This can lead to a perception among Japanese women that Western men embody these characteristics. However, it's important to remember that not all Western men are as they are portrayed in Hollywood films. Just like with any stereotype, it's not a one-size-fits-all situation. Yet the influence of these on-screen portrayals cannot be denied. They create a certain image, a certain expectation, that can impact real-world interactions and relationships. Data from various studies affirm this influence. For instance, in a recent survey it was found that around 70% of Japanese women perceived Western men as being more outgoing and assertive, traits often highlighted in Hollywood depictions. It's fascinating, isn't it? How a medium of entertainment can have such a profound influence on our perceptions and expectations. It's a testament to the power of media, and a reminder of the responsibility that comes with it. The Hollywood effect, it seems, extends far beyond the movie theater. But what happens when the credits roll, and reality sets in? Let's delve into the realities of relationships between Japanese women and Western men, a narrative that goes beyond the Hollywood glamour. The real-life tales of these relationships are woven with both challenges and rewards, and they're far more diverse than what we see on screen. In the heart of these relationships we find a blend of cultural nuances, language barriers, and differing societal expectations. But it's also these very factors that make such relationships unique and enriching. According to a study by the Ministry of Health, Labor and Welfare in Japan, approximately 1 in 30 marriages in Japan are international. 
and a significant portion of these involve Western men and Japanese women. This suggests a growing trend towards cultural amalgamation and acceptance. Another interesting statistic from the same study reveals that over half of these intercultural marriages last beyond the 15-year mark. This is a testament to their resilience and the ability of these couples to navigate the complexities of their differences. However, it's essential to remember that these relationships, like any other, aren't immune to challenges. The same study indicates that the divorce rate for these marriages is slightly higher than that of marriages between two Japanese individuals. The reasons vary, from cultural misunderstandings to differing expectations about gender roles, among other factors. But let's not forget the rewards. These relationships offer a unique opportunity for cultural exchange and understanding. Learning about a new culture, language, and way of life can be an enriching experience, broadening one's perspectives and fostering personal growth. Moreover, these relationships can contribute to greater cultural understanding and acceptance, breaking down stereotypes, and fostering a more inclusive society. So, while the Hollywood narrative might paint a rosy picture of romance between Western men and Japanese women, the reality is a complex yet rewarding tapestry of intercultural interaction, mutual respect, and love. As with any relationship, there's more than meets the eye. So, what do Japanese women themselves have to say about this? Let's dive into some first-hand perspectives. A recent survey conducted in Tokyo involving over 500 Japanese women sheds light on their views about Western men. When asked about the most appealing characteristics of Western men, the majority mentioned their respect for individuality, open-mindedness, and a perceived sense of equality in relationships. One woman in her late 20s said, I admire the Western concept of celebrating personal freedom and individuality, it's refreshing. This sentiment was echoed by many, suggesting that the Western man's more egalitarian approach to relationships is appreciated, yet it's not all rosy. Some women expressed concerns over cultural differences and communication barriers. A woman in her early 30s shared, Sometimes the cultural gap can be too wide. It's hard to bridge that without understanding and patience from both sides. Interestingly, the survey also revealed that Japanese women appreciate the physical attributes of Western men. They cited taller height and diverse physical features as attractive factors. However, it's important to note that these views do not represent all Japanese women. There's a significant portion who prefer Japanese men, citing ease of communication, shared cultural values, and understanding as key reasons. Moreover, the survey revealed that a majority of Japanese women view Western men as potential friends, rather than romantic partners. The idea of foreign friends is quite popular, with many women expressing interest in learning about different cultures and languages. On the topic of marriage, the responses were divided. While some women were open to the idea of marrying a Western man, others were reluctant, citing cultural differences and potential language barriers as concerns. Straight from the source, these insights give us a clearer picture of what Japanese women think of Western men. So, we've taken a cultural journey, explored the silver screen, peeked into the realities of relationships, and heard from Japanese women themselves. We began by dissecting the cultural differences, understanding how the East and West vary in their societal norms and values. We've seen how these differences can be both intriguing and challenging when it comes to intercultural relationships. We've also delved into the influence of Hollywood, how its portrayal of Western men can shape perceptions. From suave James Bond to the charming Prince Charming, these images are powerful, but they're also not the entire picture. We then moved into the nitty-gritty, the practical realities of relationships. We've learned that, while some Japanese women are drawn to the perceived openness and expressiveness of Western men, others find these same qualities overwhelming or off-putting. The reality is, people are individuals, and generalizations can only take us so far. Most importantly, we've given a platform for Japanese women to voice their thoughts and feelings. We've heard a range of views, from those who see Western men as exotic and exciting, to those who appreciate them as individuals beyond cultural stereotypes. We've learned that like any perception, views are shaped by personal experiences, media influences, and cultural context. In all, it's clear that this is a complex issue with no single right answer. Japanese women, like women everywhere, have diverse and nuanced views. They're not a monolithic group with a single perspective but individuals with their own thoughts and feelings. While we may not have definitive answers, we've certainly gained a deeper understanding of what Japanese women think about Western men. The beauty of cultural exchange is in its complexity, and in understanding, we build bridges.